Hey guys, I'm Mr. Joe. I'm super excited that you came today to watch Faith Kids Online. Let's go ahead and stand up and get ready to worship. We'll go dance, we're gonna sing, we're gonna get real loud, let our voices ring, we're gonna party, we're having fun with Jesus Christ, he's God's only son. Now everybody, from the front to the back, put your hands in. When it's showtime, it's okay to just sit back and watch. But when it's worship time, everybody gets up to sing. The songs that connect are an excellent way to let God know that He comes first in our life. Nothing can stop us from showing Him that He deserves our best singing and our endless energy. So get up on your feet and let's connect to God together.
I heard people don't drink enough water anyways. We are Connect HQ. Every day we help the people of the world. Live God's way. We look for the links. Make the connection. And you never know what might happen. time Connect HQ had its annual review. Then what happens? Do we both stand? Do I sit and she stands? Jake, relax. I'm nervous. This is my first evaluation. 
It's like taking a big test that it's too late to study for. Evaluation makes it sound so serious. The Connect checklist is just an opportunity for Captain Ray to make sure everything is running smoothly and we're all doing what we need to do. You're not nervous at all? Why should I be? Captain Ray loves me, and every year I get a perfect score. All check pluses. Then she thanks me for my service and I get this trophy. Check plus champion. Wow. And Captain Ray gives this to you? Nah, I give it to myself. I figure I deserve it. I made it out of an old bowling trophy. It's very nice. Sounds like we just got some mail. Dear Connect HQ, when I went to church last week, they told me that God loves me, but I don't see how. I stole a candy bar from the store a month ago, and when I didn't get caught, I did it a few more times. I kind of enjoyed it. How could God possibly love me when I like to steal things? From Alex in Texas. Hmm. Wow, yeah. Stealing is definitely bad, and Alex shouldn't do it, but... Does what we do change how God feels about us? Can you help me find the links for Alex? Definitely, but first, I need to go get my review so I can hear Ray tell me how wonderful I am. <laughs> Punctuality, check plus. Proper attire, check plus. Commitment, check plus. Follows directions, check. Professionalism. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, Captain, I think you missed a check plus there. <laughs> no, Mike, I could only give you a check for follows directions. <laughs> that's, a, that's a good one. I almost, it almost got me there. I almost fell for that. Whew. Remember last month whenever I asked you to clean the lounge, and then when I went to check, you had Tony cleaning the lounge? Yeah, I was delegating. <laughs> delegating is a good skill to have, but in that moment, I wanted you to do it. Uh, yeah, but, yeah, but, but, uh, but I, so, no check plus? <laughs> Don't be upset, Mike. We all have things that we can improve on. Why? Why? Why don't you like me anymore? Mike, I still like you. The way you perform on this checklist, it doesn't change that. I can, I can fix this. I can prove it. Mike, I'm sure by the next review, you'll be back to check plus. Next review? I need a check plus now. Here, just give me a direction. I'll follow it blindly. <sighs> Sorry, Mike. I don't have time. At any moment, Maurice is going to drop in for his review. <laughs> and there he is. Hey, hey Maurice. Maurice. <sighs> hey there. Am I early? Yeah, I need a few minutes. Oh, okay. No, Maurice. You're right on time. Okay. But I need to prove Mike, that... we can talk about it later, okay? I can't talk about it later. I... Actually, I can talk about it later because I follow directions. I'm a good direction follower. I am a check plus worthy direction follower. <laughs> oh, it's you. Hey, Mike, mm -hmm. remember that postcard? Can you help? Mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely. We need a good verse link to help Alex out. Yeah, it sounds like you got it. Good job. That's wonderful. No, I haven't. I... Shh, shh, shh. Ray's coming. Oh, it's you. Hey, guys. Hey, Maurice. Mike, you seem distracted. Would God love Alex more if he stopped stealing? The lounge is looking really clean. Great job, Maurice. What? No, it was me. I, I did that, right? That was me. Great. Now he's gone. Hey, you don't happen to know any great verses about losing God's love when we're bad. We don't lose God's love when we're bad. It says so in one of my favorite Bible verses, Romans chapter 5, verse 8. Let's say it like this. Romans 5, 8. Romans 5, 8. But here is how God has shown his love for us. But here is how God has shown his love for us. While we were still sinners... Christ died for us. While we were still sinners, Christ died for us. God loves us so much, he chose to send Jesus to die on the cross to take the punishment for our sins. He loved us even before we were born. He loved us long before we were ever sorry for our sins. 
our bad behavior, our sin, didn't stop God from loving us. That's right. I think that'll really help Alex. Thanks, Maurice. The verse link is Romans 5, 8. Verse link acquired. Can you get me a pencil? Yes, Captain. Here's your pencil as directed. Thank you. Could you sharpen it? Yes, Captain. Your direction is the thing I follow. Um, pencil sharpener, pencil sharpener. Where is a pencil sharpener? Oh, okay. Were you able to sharpen that? I work on it. Stop. What are you doing? I couldn't find a sharpener. You could have just gotten me another pencil. You didn't say get you another pencil. You said sharpen this one, and I follow orders. <laughs> Mike, you truly take the cake. I will take the cake wherever you'd like me to take it. What are you even talking about? Mike, what's really going on? I'm showing you that I can follow orders fully and that I do check plus work. I'm very happy with the work that you do. But I need you, I need you to like me again. You really think I don't like you? Get out of here. Yes, Captain. Oh, no, Mike, don't follow that order. Hey, looks like you're up to something very important. I'm trying to find the right Bible link to share with this kid, Alex, who asked for our help. The Bible is filled with so many great stories about God's love. I just want to find the perfect one. I have an idea of a Bible link that might do the job. May I? Here. This is the story about the God who loves us in the Bible. Is alive. John. Long ago, there lived a man named John. He was known as the disciple who Jesus loved. One day, Jesus invited John to follow him and be his disciple. John left his boat and nets behind to follow Jesus. Jesus talked to John and taught him many things. Jesus invited John to go many places with him. Jesus loved John very much. When things seemed scary or sad, Jesus reminded John that everything would be okay. When things were hard, Jesus was happy John was near. As he was dying on the cross, Jesus looked down at John, standing beside Mary, his mother. Jesus trusted John so much, he invited John to be in his family and take care of Mary, his mother. And, and John, John did. did. John was honored to be invited into Jesus' family and take care of his mother. John remembered the time he spent with Jesus. As Jesus was dying on the cross, John stayed close to Jesus. He stayed by Mary so he could comfort and help her. John stayed by Jesus even when things became very hard. John was sad when the soldiers came to take Jesus away. John loved Jesus very much. John had followed Jesus and helped him serve people. John always listened very closely to everything Jesus said. John was so glad that he had said yes when Jesus invited him to be his disciple. Long ago there lived a man named John. He was known as the disciple who Jesus loved. Because Jesus loved John, he invited John to be his follower. And while Jesus was dying on the cross, he invited him to be a part of his family. Jesus loved John. Not because of anything great John had done, but because of how great Jesus is. And Jesus loves us too. He calls us to follow him and to be a part of his family. They say that John was the disciple that Jesus loves. Well, Alex is the kid that Jesus loves. You should tell Alex that. No sin can take away from that love. Just like no big thing we can achieve can make God's love bigger. Someone should probably tell Mike that. He seems pretty distracted by check pluses today. That gives me an idea.
What are you doing, Maurice? Uh, this device helps me to see behind the walls to the ductwork underneath. I think we have a blockage somewhere. The air isn't flowing as it should. Have you seen Mike? Yeah, just a few minutes ago. I was telling Mike about how blocked the air ducts and the rafters were. I see. Wait. What were your words exactly to him? I think I said, you have to go up and see how bad it is up there. Oh, no. Uh, uh, oh! Hey, Mike. Hey, Mike. Is that how I look coming down? Oh. I... I am going to go get some aspirin. Oh. Freeze. Turn around. Come here. <laughs> Mike, there's something you need to know. I know. I <laughs> disappointed you. I'm not doing check plus work. <laughs> no, Mike. <laughs> Jake wrote this, and I think you need to read it. Uh. I am loved because God loves me. Yes, and everyone here at Connect HQ loves you too. It doesn't matter how you do on some review, but most importantly... I am loved because God loves me. <laughs> yes, just like when you sin, it doesn't take away from that love. No big achievement that you make can add to that love either. He already loves you perfectly. <laughs> so you don't like me less because I didn't get a check plus? <laughs> of course not. You know what? I think we've all had quite the day. I say we go find Jake and the four of us go get some ice cream. I shouldn't. I'm really watching my calories. No, that's a mandatory order. Okay, let's go then. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was scary. Wait, we can get check pluses on those evaluations? When does anybody tell me these things? All right, guys, I'm so glad that you guys get to watch Faith Kids with us today. I have one challenge for you to find a trusted adult and tell them one thing that you've learned from today's video. Also, tell them to check out our Faith Kids Facebook group. I pray blessings over you and your family through this week.